Hi guys, it's Shani from Yanomize and I am at Topaz Detailing. They do all the supercars and the hypercars. They are the best in the industry. I've got Mazin with me and I've got Nabil with me. Today, we're talking about a partnership. There's a new product called Topaz Skin. Nabil, what is it? What's, what's the new thing that everyone's talking about? Topaz Skin is a peelable paint. So essentially, it's a paint that goes onto the car that you can take off. But the difference is, is that you can select exactly what color code you want. So what paint you want, whether it's a BMW, McLaren, Ferrari, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. You can choose exactly the color you want. Mazin, why did you think it'd be a good idea for ourselves to partner up? Well, Yanni, yeah, we've been working together indirectly for a number of years and we've always had a mutual respect. You've always done the color changes and the wraps. We've always done the clear, transparent and detailing. But we thought, it's only logical for us to partner up, take this to the next level as two brands, do it together and really give our clients and our prospective clients something that's cutting edge and new for the next generation. My Lamborghini Urus is here. We've chosen an unbelievable color for it. Yeah, and you're gonna see start to finish. This Sunday coming is Supercar Sunday. And if you see on my TV show, Yanni Supercar Customizer, I always say we can do a car in one day or two days. So this Sunday, guys, is Supercar Sunday. We want to take the Urus to the show. Exactly. Nice. Are you going to pull it off? Nice. Yeah, yeah. Well, we don't have much time, day and night, we'll do it. We'll do it, we'll do it. We'll do it. You're the one who usually gets asked that question. Can you pull it off? So let's see if these guys can pull it off and find out all about Topaz Skin. So the car comes in and gets decontaminated and gets detailed. So to make sure that the paint surface is absolutely perfect before we apply anything, whether it's paint protection film or it's topaz skin. Once that's done, the car then goes upstairs into our purpose-built facility to be able to go through the process of prepping for the skin. Now the prepping stage takes different forms, masking, further decontamination, some panel wipe, etc. just to make sure that the surface of the paint is absolutely pristine before the product goes on there. Then it goes into our spray booth. Now this spray booth is bespoke, made for us, specifically with this product in mind. So the filters, the way that the extraction is, the way that the heating is, the way that the temperature rises gradually, all these kind of things are bespokely done for us to be able to make sure we get the best possible finish within this product. Our Topaz skin has different stages. The first stage is the base coat. The base coat essentially is the actual technology part of our product. It has a peelable proportion of the paint, and so essentially you can apply it on, and then you can apply anything on top of it, and that will be able to peel off. And I really mean any color on top of it. So you can choose any color that you wish, whether it's a Ferrari red, or a Lamborghini green, or a Bentley blue. You can even do flip colors. There are hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of different paints. And that's the nice thing about this. The only limitation to this product is your imagination. So at this stage, you can basically have an artist to airbrush on anything you want on top of it, whether it's skulls or pictures of your dog or whatever it is that you want to do. You'll be able to spray that on, and then once we put the clear cut on, that seals it in. So it's really flexible in terms of what we can do, but the complexity can go from just a normal color change or from white to triple layer black with a skull down the side of it. So it really depends on what the customer wants. That's the one. 
the UK market never had the full spectrum of paint to sample colors available. So the vision behind Skin was we need a product that looks like paint, feels like paint, but you don't have to essentially respray the car and ruin the originality of the car by applying it. Yanni's car, his Aorus, looks incredible. It's a triple layer Lamborghini purple and it is amazing. If you get a chance, have a look at it. It just looks phenomenal. Now, people ask me, what are the telltale signs of having skin on the car? There are none. I physically cannot tell if the car's been skinned or the car is painted like that from the factory. That's the beauty about that product. And if I can't tell, I can guarantee you no one else can. Once it comes out of the booth, it's ready to get polished now. And what I mean by polished is basically paint correction. So we're essentially removing the peaks and troughs out of the clear coat to be able to get the perfect finish. The customer can choose between what her OEM finishes, which has got some orange peel on it, or with the ultimate finish, which is the Topaz signature detail, and that's basically removing all of the orange peel. And it'll essentially look like glass. So the customers have two options. So we talked about the process, we talked about what's involved, what do you think of the end result? It's actually unbelievable and obviously this is three stage pearl as well. Yeah, yeah. This looks like a paint job, I'd never believe this could actually be removed. And that's the thing, if you look at it, even when you get up close and personal, it's a paint job. Because it is a paint job. But it's removable paint. It's removable. It's a game changer. So what do you think in terms of the market of obviously colour change and stuff like that, what's your What's your opinion? A lot of times when customers said to me, I want this specific colour on a Ferrari or on a Lambo or on a Porsche, I can't do it. Whereas I can say, you know what, I can't wrap it however, on the skin I can get you the exact paint coat to whatever finish, whatever colour you want. And this is obviously the Lambo colour. Yeah. Uh, Passifé? Yeah, Passifé. Which yeah. is special. And the finish is phenomenal, isn't it? It's a mirror finish. Um, I love the fact that you can flatten polish it. Yep. You can yep. get out any imperfections. You can treat it like paint. So after once it's done, you can wax it, polish it. You put ceramic coating on top, treat it like paint. Similar to PPF, it's self-healing. So when you, when you get swell marks when you're washing the car during yep. washing techniques, it will disappear once it gets a bit of heat on it. So it's, it's a, added another little cherry on the, on the cake, isn't it? As I said, you've got the PPF market locked down. I've got the wrap game locked down. And with Topaz Skin together, I think the two, I call it juggernauts of the yeah. industry world, <laughs> teaming up. I think it, there's no stopping us. And this is a great, great product. Uh, one thing actually, guys, I didn't tell you at home, just quickly look at this. What I've done was I wanted to show people. If you look here on this side, we've done the shuts and returns in purple. But on my other side, we actually left it factory gray. And the reason we've done that is so people can actually see the finish. You can see the original color and you can see what it looks like with an actual finish where you paint the hinges, etc. So we've actually done that on the car because I know some people are going to see my car open one side and they'll be like, hold a minute, they didn't do both sides. So that is the reason for that. I'm about to take this now to Supercar Sunday where you guys are going to see it for the first time. The sun is shining outside. So I hope that goes down really, really well. And um, there'll be loads more content to come and we'll be talking more about Topaz Skin. A lot of people are going to try and compare this to other products in the market. You need to see this to really believe how good it is. For myself, <laughs> Madden and Nabil, yeah. it's a beautiful family. Yes. Thank you so much for watching, guys, and we'll see you soon. Thank you. There she is. I wasn't going to bring it today, but I thought, why not?